Hey everyone, it's Kong again with another summoning session. This time I'm going to be summoning on Abyssal Apocalypse, hoping to get one copy of Licorice. And I guess the last time I did a summoning session was when I went to Pity for Virash, my guaranteed Virash. This one's a little bit different because it's a character I actually want. Um, I do have 20 summons piled up towards my Pity already because I fired a couple shots at this one. I have a 5-star Elwyn, a 5-star Leon, and a 5-star, almost 6-star Bernhardt. So I actually got uh, I got an Elwyn to work towards my eventual 6-star. I'm not sharding him up or anything, but I figure if I get off banners or easy pulls like that, I might as well. So yeah, the long and short of it is I have 20 summons that I did on that banner that I saved for this one. So my hope here is basically just to pull Licorice and then eject, and I know some people have been having some really rotten luck on this banner, but some people have been having pretty good luck too, so I mean I guess that's always the case. You just have to hope to be on the right side. So let's jump in with my first 10 pull. Oh, one thing I should check is my volume too, because I usually keep my volume off on my PC. Just because when I'm recording stuff, it's very loud in my headset. So this is just going to be nothing. I'm actually going to back out really quick just to make sure I can change my volume. So that you can hear what's going on. Oh yeah, look at all that muted stuff. Look at all that. Don't worry, I'll blank out my account details so you can't steal my account. Uh, okay, so back into summons. So I have one summon on this banner, plus the two already from Elwyn, which means... I better mark that down, too. Which means I'm 30 towards pity, technically. So getting Licorice really early here would be really nice. I'm not planning on spending or anything for the next few banners, even though there are some characters that I would like to pull. Uh, for example, the upcoming Bozel Liana Luna banner is another one where I do have um, Liana six star already, but the other two are five star. So if I got Liana, I could trade towards the other two. Yeah, and any one of those pulls would be beneficial in the long run. So this was the third summon. And it's another one with nothing. So with the banked pity from last time, that was technically the fifth one, which means we're going to be going over the average rate again. What's new, right? So this will be the fourth one of today, sixth overall. Okay, so this is the fifth of today. Maybe it'll give me an uh, SSR here, so it, it feels like it's giving me something in the average rate. Yep. Even though we know it's not really. So let's see what kind of luck we have here. Fingers crossed. Not gonna lie, all these Lesters so far make me feel like it's gonna be Renata. Yeah, I know, she likes to follow Lester around. Well, I don't mind adding her to the collection at least, but it does mean I'm gonna have to jump back in and keep summoning. Okay, so technically that's 70 summons for one Renata. And the pity starts over again, and we are going to hope that Licorice prefers the clean slate, maybe. So let's see if she'll come home right away. I'm not planning on breaking the bank for Licorice, even though I do actually intend to use her in my Apex box. Like, she's a character I plan to add to my team. I'm not going to go broke for a character that's in the regular summoning pool. 
even if she doesn't have a destiny banner coming up, I do need to save for Reen, ultimately. So this is going to be the third pull of this fresh summoning session for Licorice. We are going to get someone. So maybe it's Licorice trying to show up Renata and come home in a much nicer, more balanced number of pulls. I better not accidentally skip. Just out of habit. You're so used to not getting good stuff, right? There's another Cursed Lester. Yep, there it is again. Another Renata. There's still hope, right? Nope, there's no hope. Okay. At least that was only three. So three more summons for another Renata, which means total two Renatas in a hundred summons. Technically on the average rate, it's just not the character we wanted. So let's see what we can do. I have about 200 summons left. Statistically, I think that tells me I should get a Licorice. Not gonna be happening here. So we'll jump back in. I asked for requests before recording this video, and Antero said to get a five star Licorice, which unfortunately doesn't look like that's happening now. Maybe a five star Renata. Okay, so just on the second summon of this session, another SSR. Hopefully, this is Licorice so I can fully eject and salvage what I can. So nervous now. There was a Lester. Think positive thoughts, Kong. Think positive thoughts. Think positive thoughts, Roga. Hey, there we go! Okay. Perfect. We got Bozel. Well, that is my ultimate goal right there. I got the character that I wanted. Doesn't really matter to me if she's only 3 star, because eventually I'm going to be sharding her up. Maybe she'll show up as an off-banner summon at some point in the future. And the weird um, two copies of Renata are just kind of gravy. Probably not going to use her or build her, but at least I'll have her in the box just in case anything weird happens that I end up needing her. Um, so yeah, that was I consider that to be a fairly successful session, just because I still have almost 200 pulls left. A couple banners coming up that... I can skip the Akaya Emilia banner. Like I said, the Bozel Liana Luna one, I'll be tempted just to pop one SSR out of if possible, and if not, I can carry that pity towards the Reen banner, which will be following closely on its heels. So in decent shape going into the next few weeks, I'm gonna leave it there. So thanks for your mediocre luck, moderate, moderately decent luck. That sounds better. That sounds less offensive than mediocre. Thanks for watching. I hope you have better luck than me. I hope you get the character you were pulling for, and I'll catch you in the next one. Happy Langrissing.